रेपोरेट अपरिवर्तित रखिला आरबीआई 6.5 प्रतिशत सहित रेपोरेट बलवत्तर रहिछि एने प्रेस मीट करि सूचना दिछन्ति आरबीआई गवर्नर शक्तिकांत दास 3 दिन धरि चलिथिबा आरबीआई रो मॉनेटरी पॉलिसी कमिटी बैठक रे ए निष्पत्ति लिया जाय छि एवेन्यूज आर बिकमिंग मोर अट्रैक्टिव to retail customers and banks are facing challenges on the funding front with bank deposits trailing loan growth as a result banks are taking greater recourse to short term non retail deposits and other instruments of liability to meet the incremental credit demand this as i have emphasized elsewhere may potentially expose the banking system to structural liquidity issues banks may therefore focus more on mobilization of household financial savings through innovative products and service offerings and by leveraging fully on their vast branch network this is the first point which i wanted to highlight in the context of the financial sector you see as i mentioned a little while ago the overall financial sector continues to be healthy and stable as the regulator of certain segments of the financial sector it's our responsibility to point out the possible or the potential areas where risks may come up and it's our responsibility to just suggest to the banks to the nbfcs and other financial institutions to be extra careful and to give extra to keep extra vigil on certain aspects which is not a problem at the moment but if unattended can become a problem at a later stage but so far as the current scenario is concerned and so far as the overall financial sector outlook is concerned the i would like to again reiterate and reemphasize that india's financial sector remains stable and healthy now in this context the second point which i would like to mention is that the sectors in which preemptive regulatory measures were announced by the reserve bank in november last year have shown moderation in credit growth november uh, credit growth however certain segments of personal loans continue to witness high growth excess leverage through retail loans mostly for consumption purposes needs careful monitoring from macro prudent from macro prudential point of view it calls for careful assessment and calibration of underwriting standards as may be required as well as post sanction monitoring of such loans most of the banks are doing it but we need to constantly reemphasize this point the third issue that is attracting our attention is home equity loans or top up housing loans as they are called in india which have been growing at a brisk pace जदि आपन को आम भिडी भल लगला तेब चेल्क लाइक सेयार और सब्सक्राइब करने को जमा भी बुलां नहीं